we have a package. <laughs> so that means we got an unpacking. Only downfall. Wonderful postal carriers. <laughs> Take too good a care of it. Hopefully that won't affect it. But we will see. See what happens. Open it up. I'm assuming this is either a Kickstarter or a zoo for whatever. I don't think I have anything ordered that I'm waiting for at the moment. But I could be wrong. All right. Looks like everything will be all right. All right, that's cool. I know what this is. Dead Dwellings number six. Final book on this run. That looks like the postal damage, thankfully, didn't, didn't wreck that comic. Been a real bummer. I love these. Nice and thick. You got the old school look to them with the printing. All kinds of fun little things inside that we got to check out. But yeah, you can see the nice layout how they do it just gives you that old school comics feel the old golden age silver age on advertisements in there it's all kinds of great old goofy ads that they have throughout these books the series has been so much fun only thing i'm confused about is in the previews they've had uh, oops, crap and stuff now. I'm gonna damage the post office damage in, I guess. But, uh, they had dwellings number one, two, three. I assume that's from this set run. It looked like different covers. So I wasn't sure, and I was debating on ordering them just in case. But I can't remember. I might have, I might have pre ordered them, but. Thing I love is I love these postcards that they have with these different issues. I cuckoo. These little scary, scary children's horror style put on their postcards. All the stuff, all the legal stuff on the back. Caddy and the doll. What was the other one before that? Road of Penmark. Kid Ba. <laughs> Claudia wants more. So they have a very annoying child. <laughs> and Miles and Flora. Love these. It's hard to hold on to them when the wife sees them. She wants to take them. I think we have them all now in our her books. I got back the ones she tried to sneak away. And then what other goodies we got here? Oh, yeah, they usually always have one of these print and prints that they have. Looks like a girl was buried and a tree was planted over her body. Awesome little crows sitting there hanging out. Waiting to release her soul. <laughs> uh, another postcard. Oh, this is awesome. Familiar horror from within dwellings. Oh, that, that, I'd love to see a whole set of these. Or just as covers for the next round of dwellings. I, I just love that EC horror. Look, endearingly creepy tales of terror. Yeah, that featuring jack o' lantern, the murder crows, or the murder birds, and the devil himself. 
deadly tales of despair in the tradition, in the EC tradition, EC comics tradition. And then, I believe our final thing here is our poster. Undergrowth. He tried to warn them. Their children were in danger. Nobody listened. Now their children are trees. Haunt, make a haunted woods full of trees planted on top of dead bodies. That a good storyline. <laughs> Who knows? That might be in this book. I have not read it yet. I will read it. I will review it. Very soon in an upcoming episode of Under the Cult of MS Comic Book. Reviews, uh, comic book reviews. Yeah, keep an eye out for that on YouTube. Keep following under the color of mess. Rate, review, tell a friend. Check out Chris the Color Comic Club. Lots of fun episodes from the past few months. So check those out. Lots of great club picks that we'll be talking about coming up. Some more fun ones. I'm really looking forward to getting in the mail, hopefully soon, some more. <laughs> this is my last month's shipment came in a little late, so I was thinking this month's would come in early. Nope. No luck. They must be shifting my shipping date around, pushing it up a week or so. But we will have to see what happens. But we will get more stuff for you in the future so keep following us and tell a friend and help us out we'll talk to you again soon